Welcome to Headline News 24-7. Please click like and subscribe. Shocking new documents leak Barack Obama's attempt to undermine Trump prior to inauguration. Shocking new documents have just been released to the American public by the American Center for Law and Justice, which proves that the Obama White House attempted to undermine the incoming Trump administration just days prior to Donald Trump's inauguration. As reported by Fox News, the ACLJ, where I serve as chief counsel, has obtained records that show the Office of the Director of National Intelligence under Director James Clapper eagerly pushed to get new procedures as part of an anti-Trump effort. The procedures increased access to raw signals intelligence before the inclusion of the Obama administration, just days before President Trump was inaugurated. By greatly expanding access to classified information by unelected, unaccountable bureaucrats, the Obama administration paved the way for a shadow government to leak classified information, endangering our national security and severely jeopardizing the integrity and reputation of our critical national security apparatus in an attempt to undermine President Trump. How did the Obama administration get away with treating a president-elect in such a way? Fox's Jay Seclau explains an old, open-ended piece, as I told Sean Hannity on his Fox News Channel program, the documents were obtained as a result of one of our Freedom of Information Act lawsuits, this one against the Office of the Director of National Intelligence and National Security Agency. The documents confirmed what we suspected. The Office of the Director of National Intelligence rushed to get the new procedures signed by the Attorney General before the conclusion of this administration, referring to the Obama administration. According to Saclau, these new release documents show that Robert Litt, while working in the office of the Director of National Intelligence, stated that they really want to get this done, and so does the boss. The office of the Undersecretary of Defense's Director of Intelligence Strategy, Policy, and integration, it is thought that the boss means Director James Clapper. According to Saclau, the documents the ACLJ received that were produced by the National Security Agency showed that NSA officials discussed they could have a signature from the AG as early as this week, certainly prior to the 20th of January. In other words, certainly before President Trump's inauguration. Bongino.com explains that the shocking new documents confirmed what Saclau already suspected. The Office of the Director of National Intelligence rushed to get the new procedures signed by the Attorney General before the conclusion of this administration, referring to the Obama administration. The documents also show that Odney employee Robert Litt told the Office of Undersecretary of Defense's Director of Intelligence Strategy, Policy, and Integration really want to get this done, and so does the boss. Boss most likely being a reference to DNI Director Clapper. That was the news. We thought you might be interested in knowing about this. Please click like and subscribe. Thank you.